what is inertia? I mean, this was a question that was asked online and I'm going to answer it with a demo. Now, this demo, if you've seen some videos online, I like to watch some videos online. There are some people that like do stuff with axes. And there's a guy, and I can't remember his name, but he chops wood, and I don't know why, it's very compelling. I like to watch this guy chop wood. I wanna be friends with him. And then there's a girl that chops wood too, and she's just as great. Finally, there's a guy, and he must be English or something, I don't know. He's got an accent. And he repairs old tools, and he chops wood sometimes too, but he really repairs stuff. And all these people do the same thing. So if they take uh, an object like this and they want to repair the handle, so they'll take the new handle and then they'll hold it like this and hammer it in and it goes into the, the handle. And I'm gonna show you that demo right here. So this is a block of wood. And I put a little tape there just for a marker. And I'm going to hammer the top of this and then we can see what happened. I'm gonna stand back a little bit. And you see that it's kind of hard to tell. Let me hammer it this way first get the tape back. I want to get the tape. It's, it's really hard, you know, when you're hitting, you're trying to make sure you're still not doing things. I'm watching the tape and hitting up here, and I don't want to hit myself in the head. But here we go. Okay, let me just hold it right here. Hammer this thing in. I almost hit myself. Okay, there we go. So now I have the tape right there. I'm going to hammer the stick, and you can see the tape moves down. I'm a physicist, I'm not a hammerer. But it is moving down. Okay, so how does this work and what does this have to do with inertia and what is inertia? Inertia is the property of an object that wants to resist changes in motion. So it's really just mass, right? The more mass something has, the more resistance to change in motion that it has. And this block has mass. So when I hit this, this moves down, but that's like, hey, I got mass, I don't wanna move. And that's what inertia is. So it's a property of objects to resist changes in motion. It's that mass in F net equals MA. That's Newton's second law, you've seen that. So that's what's happening here. So just imagine that I'm doing this in slow motion. I hit this with a hammer and my stick wants to move down, but that's like, hey, I don't want to move. So the ending result is that the stick moves down a little bit and that stays where it's at. Now let me show you a variation of this that's kind of fun. So if, if I take this and I put it right here, you can't really see, but if I prop it up against something, then when I hit the top, the stick doesn't move down because it's resting on something. And that means that that stays where it's at. It's a little loud, I'm not gonna hit it super hard, but. It didn't move at all. There you go, inertia.